Well, thank you very much, Matt. Penn State made a major change today, saying goodbye to a coach that led the women's basketball program for more than a decade, uh, refusing to renew her contract. Our sports director, Peter Terpstra, has you covered on Penn State's newest coaching search from Nittany Nation. Hey there, Pete. Hey guys, yeah, it's a kind of a gloomy day out here outside of the Bryce Jordan Center. It's a gloomy day uh, for the Penn State women's basketball program right now. Penn State has parted ways with head women's basketball coach Coquise Washington. Now, athletic director Sandy Barber just met with the members of the media here at the Bryce Jordan Center a little longer than an hour ago to tell us why. She says Penn State has reached a point where they were consistently not competitive. The team last made the NCAA tournament in 2014, and in Washington's final game, as head coach, the team exited the first round of the Big Ten tournament. Just another point leading to today. From a big picture standpoint, um, you know, certainly disappointing, but, but I know our coaching staff and our team shared that disappointment. It was another uh, symbol uh, or another indication uh, that we lost our competitiveness, and, uh, and that we need to correct. So let's break down some numbers in Washington's 12 years at Penn State. The team won 55% of its games, 209 wins, 169 losses. In Big Ten play, the mark was lower, 48% of those 12 years. But the last five years is something to pay attention to. Penn State just won 44% of its games, two trips to the NIT, no NCAA tournament appearances for a team that has made the NCAA tournament 25 times. That's the most out of anybody in the Big Ten. This last year, 12-18, and 18, only five Big Ten wins and a first-round exit, as you heard, in the Big Ten tournament. Now, Stick with us. We got a lot more coming on this again coming up at six. We'll kind of take a look at some of the accomplishments of Coach Coquise Washington and how Penn State wants to move forward. Reporting from University Park, Peter Terpstra for Nittany Nation. Thank you, Peter. And remember, WTAJ News is your Nittany Nation station. You can find the latest updates not only on air but online at wearecentralpa.com. Look for the Nittany Nation category under the Sports tab.